comfortable? Hmm? Good morning, everybody. It is Tuesday. Hmm. And, um... I don't have any idea what I'm going to be doing today. I'm uh, on the computer right now looking at uh, ads for employment. I'll be doing that this morning, as usual. And um, we'll have to see. It depends on the weather, I think. If the weather's okay, we may get out and uh, do some more gardening. Hello, everybody. I am. Um Got my voice back, not completely 100%, but you can hear me. <laughs> <clears throat> I hope everybody had a fabulous day today. Ours was very uneventful. Everybody has gone home, so it was a very quiet day. Our regular nurse is out sick today. So we had a different nurse, and she was okay. We want Donna back. <laughs> we like our nurses. Once we once we get a nurse and you get attached to somebody, you know, it, it's hard to switch. It's hard to switch up. I know, I look a mess, guys. I took a shower and just kind of put my hair up in a ponytail. Um, my dad's got a new issue going on, and this is why we wanted... Um, our nurse back today he's having a hard time swallowing and we're hoping it's just part of the whole allergy cold thing that's going on but he said he feels like there's a lump or a bubble in his throat and it's making it hard to swallow it hurts he has to take little itty bitty sips of uh, fluid, whatever it is that he's drinking, and um, small, small bites of whatever it is that he's eating. Otherwise, he can't seem to swallow it. And he's also having extremely, extremely bad indigestion. No matter what he eats, even while he's sleeping, I hear him um, kind of burping up, and, and uh, you can tell it's hurting him. So that has us a little concerned. If it doesn't clear up, and if the swallowing issue doesn't clear up within the next couple of days, um, we're going to call hospice and request a visit to see the doctor so it's something we're keeping a close eye on but uh, on a good note um, I don't know if Kevin has mentioned anything he is going to come out um, to North Carolina to be with me for about a week he's coming out on April 11th yay um, very excited about that I get to spend some time with him I don't know how long I'm going to be here, so so that makes it a little a little more difficult, um, not knowing. So right now I'm sitting in my mother's bedroom. My mom's out in the living room with my dad, and I got Romeo and Tasha right here on the bed. Don't they look like two little twins? <laughs> They're just so cute. Okay, it was gorgeous this morning, but it's uh, clouded over. Got no sun anymore. It's kind of patchy, but it's been uh, pretty much a cloud cover since around noon, and the temperature's dropped. It's in the probably lower 60s right now, which is uh, not the coldest it's been here in Southern California, but it's the coldest it's been this year. So, uh, there's a lot of things I could do today, and um, I'm having a hard time getting motivated to do anything. So uh, what I've started doing is uh, I'm starting to cut down this cardboard again. 
So I still got quite a bit of it. Most of the trash has been picked up and I have some empty trash cans. But I still have a pile of cardboard. And the more I cut this down, the happier I'm going to be. This is a Kodak moment. Kodak moment. Coco. Coco! Kodak and Coco! Come here, Kodak. That was too cute. That was too cute. Coco! Coco, stop eating trees! Come here, Coco! Coco, come here, Coco. Come here! <laughs> okay, so I decided to make Boomer a boombox, so maybe he'll stop attacking the furniture and stuff. So I'll put this in the front room for her. Okay, so there it is. The beam box. <laughs> My babies. Kevin, I'm bringing two dogs home with me. This is Kodak. He's coming home with me. Whether Trey likes it or not. And that's Coco. She's coming home with me too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I was wrong. It's now raining. We just had uh, some thunder. So uh, we're having a bit of a thunderstorm. It'll probably go by real fast. Sun's still out. Kind of. I had to quickly cover up some stuff out here because I certainly didn't expect it to rain. I got the front of the house more or less cleared. Today. Okay, so that's it for me over here in California. Uh, we're all doing pretty well. I think the rain has stopped. Um, Boomer is enjoying his boom box. Freckles always looking for something to eat, no matter where. Um, uh, Daryl's still recuperating from Easter. And um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll get it over to Val. Wake up! So, um, in regards also to the other issue that we were having with my father not being able to go to the bathroom, now we're having the opposite problem we cannot get him to stop going to the bathroom so we have stopped with the milk of magnesia and we're going to stop with the stool softeners for a couple of days or a day or so and once he stops going then we'll start with the stool softeners again so hopefully we can get all of that under control uh, just craziness, craziness, craziness. Um, but all in all, it's been a quiet day here. And I've been doing a lot of coloring and just relaxing. Pa's been doing uh, a lot of sleeping and listening to the country music playlist on my iPod that I set up for him. And actually singing in his sleep so anyway that's about it guys um 
sorry I didn't do much filming today, but I hope you enjoyed whatever Kevin and them did on their end. And if you did, please give us a great big thumbs up. And if you have not done so already, please press that little red subscribe button down below right. and help your neighborhood community to grow. And right. share this video with absolutely everybody you know. And the Lone Wolf has something he'd like to say. Thumbs up, everybody. <laughs> it's been a rough day, but it's all right. Turn out okay. And just make sure you press that other button. That's keep right. Keep things rolling. That's right. All right. Good night. <laughs>